Tony Gonzalez now available. First questions from Alana Rizzo, go ahead. Morning, Tony. What do you take out of the first outing so far in this postseason now that you've had an opportunity to kind of go back and, and look at, at all of your pitches? Uh, yeah, definitely, you know, going back, watching the game, can tell that I was getting a little bit tired. Um, you know, not, not pitching a little bit. Uh, my sharpness definitely wasn't there, but overall, I thought the movement and and like everything was still working the same way that I wanted to work. Just my execution wasn't as good. Do you think the fatigue kind of stemmed from just the adrenaline of the moment, just the pressure of the moment, or more of just the time of season for you? Uh, there's probably a lot of factors that go come into play. Uh, you know, having you know a live B, one live BP between. Um, my second line B, BP kind of sh cut short the, you know, the, the adrenaline and the, the heat of the moment kind of factoring and being a little bit more intense. Um, you know, there's a lot to say. There's nothing, not one thing that I can like point my finger at. Moving forward, what do you think you've done to make sure that that doesn't happen again? Uh, you know, just try to get my body as ready as I can. Uh, it's been different I guess in between these starts you know I have to be uh, available if they call my name to you know come out of the bullpen or put cleats on in case you know we go into extras or something like that but um, you know just trying to be as ready as I can be. Do you know what's next for you? Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to see if I'm available today and then we'll go from there. Okay thanks for your time. Thank you. Next question is from Dave Vasse. Go ahead. Are you trying to make a statement with that t-shirt? Oh, it's a pretty nice shirt. I feel like it's aggressive. It's like, you know, what we need to do today, be aggressive. <laughs> okay. Uh, Tony, all year long, it seems like you've been able to adapt to whatever the Dodgers have asked you to do. How have you been able to be successful with all the different, uh, you know, changes to your season? Uh, I think just especially going back to the uh, the alternate site, just trying to take every outing that I had as, you know, as much game-like as I could. Um, you know, we were fortunate enough to have really good hitters down at our, our alternate site. So it was, competition was there and uh, the fun and the like competitive, competitive atmosphere was like very good down at that alternate site. Um, but yeah, I think that's one of the biggest things. Thank you. Next question is from Kyle Glazer. Go ahead. Hey, Tony. Um, obviously, the year began, you uh, had the, the positive test. Um, when you kind of just look at this whole year from that positive test to your late start to where you are now, just kind of how do you assess what this year has been like for you? Um, I feel like there's definitely been a little bit of adversity to go through. But, uh, you know, overall, it's a big learning experience for me. Um, you know, I got some consistent starts, which is great, you know, trying to maneuver lineups more than two times through. Um, something I hadn't really done that much in the past. Uh, so there's definitely just a lot of learning that came out of it. Yeah, obviously you got to the majors last year as well. What's been the biggest difference for you here in year two? Uh, I feel like I'm a lot more consistent this year. I think my the way my pitches are moving and the thought behind each of them and the a little bit extra like competitive edge is, is a lot better this year. Thank you. Next question is from Bill Plunkett. Go ahead. Tony, we'll play along and pretend that you're not the game seven starter, but if you are, how do you feel about being uh, given the ball in such an important situation? Um, yeah, I think it's the same situation as you know, game two, game three, game four, game one. It's all the same to me. I uh, just got to go out there and, and throw my game. Thanks. And then I got time for one more. Go ahead, Jorge. Tony, you mentioned that you have to be ready for a new situation. Have you been ready the last, you know, last night or something like that? Would you have been able to, to pitch? Yeah, absolutely. I, um, I mean, they would have gave me ample notice if I had to go down to the bullpen. So 
it's just a matter of you know putting the cleats on and mentally I felt like I was I was in the game the whole game yesterday so have you like thrown a side session a bullpen anything in the last couple of days or you're just kind of been just holding out I threw a bullpen two days ago but that doesn't change the fact that I got to be ready uh, you know yesterday or today and then as well as tomorrow thank you Go ahead, Kyle. Sorry, that was a... Thanks, Tony.